If you've worked on site, you'll understand. Non-standard pipelines often have misalignment or gaps. Usually, inexperienced welders or even some old-timers who stick to habits will choose stop-start tack welding. But for this kind of job, there's really no need. If the gap isn't too big, we can use the continuous arc tack method. First, run a pass over it, then switch to continuous arc welding. This way, it saves both effort and time. Let's see how to make these tacks. We choose continuous arc welding, placing a tack every two to three centimeters. Of course, the denser the better. When the temperature is right, the denser the tacks, the easier it is to handle the next layer. In simple terms, the first pass is just laying down tacks. With so many points, the weld can withstand more heat. So when we go into continuous arc welding, it becomes much easier. After tacking, the shape is already set. Next comes the continuous arc weld. No extra tricks are needed. Use a 42 electrode, standard pipe welding technique. Apply a zigzag weave, keep the current low, press the arc steadily, and let the electrode follow the curve of the pipe to maintain the angle. Now let's look at the weld formation. This is the final result. Working like this is faster and more efficient, so why wouldn't we do it this way? That's all for today's share. Have you learned something, brothers? If this was helpful for you, please give a like and subscribe Weldmaster India for more videos.